Hello, things are changing in the marine electronics industry with the introduction of a new open source interfacing standard called Signal-K. We're lucky to have lots of bright and visionary customers within the marine industry and a group of talented developers who were also boaters working for some of the world's top technology companies decided that they wanted more from boat systems in terms of integration and interfacing. They worked collaboratively on a new open source marine data standard called Signal-K to not only interface with onboard electronics, but also to interface any marine asset from boats to buoys, harbors to ships or marinas. Welcome to Next Generation Interfacing and the Signal-K platform. So let's look at why we need Signal-K and walk through the history of marine interfacing. We're probably all familiar with NMEA and in the past it's been perfect for linking chart plotters to pilots and instruments. It's evolved from the simple NMEA 0183 standard based around one device talking to others at a very slow speed of 4800 baud to the new NMEA 2000 standard based on reliable CAM-based technology from the auto industry where multiple devices can exist on one bus. But even NMEA 2000 is slow, running at 250 kilobits a second, and in today's gigabit world, it's like dial-up in a broadband age. It's also expensive to develop for, with certification and documentation costs which stifle innovative product development. Hence the need for a new standard and Signal K. But it's difficult to change an incumbent technology, and that's where iCommunicate finds its roots. It acts as an interface from legacy NMEA 0183 and current NMEA 2000 based systems to the new open source environment. It may take a while for a new depth sounder to become Signal K ready, but there's hundreds of thousands of NMEA compatible devices already afloat just awaiting a link to the next generation of interfacing in the Internet of Things. iCommunicate enables legacy and existing systems to make a leap into this capability today. Like any new standard, commercial pressures overarch the desire to break out a new technology. To help, Digital Yacht created a Kickstarter crowdfunded project for the iCommunicate interface, which was a marine industry first. Not necessarily to generate cash for development, but to see if there was an appetite for change. Clearly there was, with a five times over subscription and over $100,000 raised in days, only back in November 2015. Knowing that there was a market allowed super fast development with a team in the UK and the US going from design to manufacture of iCommunicate within six months. Signal-K is an HTML5 web-ready JSON-based data format that makes web and mobile app development really simple, even for amateurs. Apps can be written in minutes and data viewed within a browser. Here's a typical application. NMEA 2000 engine data such as fuel flow, temperature and pressure could be logged locally on an iPad and then uploaded to the cloud and analyzed for any trends indicating an engine service requirement iCommunicate can also act as a simple onboard web server, so PDF manuals can be stored and viewed as required. Files can be saved on the integrated SD card reader. Here's another application, digital switching. Consumer systems like Wemo from Belkin are cheap and easy to install. And with a Signal-K interface, control via marine networks is simplified. iCommunicate works great with consumer devices like iPads, tablets, PCs, and Macs. It even works with the Kindle with a free app available to display instrument data. Twitter and Facebook integration is simple, so your boat can start to develop its own online presence. The sky really is the limit. Most importantly, iCommunicate is manufacturer agnostic and integrates with any system, cutting edge or legacy, so older systems don't need to be replaced to add connectivity. It's the interface for any marine electronics system iCommunicate is also simple to install, especially on NMEA 2000 networks, as it just tees into the network backbone. Plus, it's great value too, at just $299, available globally and shipping now. The press are also impressed with its game-changing technology. Come on, don't be an interfacing dinosaur, and thanks for listening.